Your mover's working great. Hey, Bray. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Brianna, look at this insect I found. <laughs> wow, let me see. Brianna, tell him. Kevin, I'm sorry, but we can't be friends anymore. I'm trying to get boys to fall in love with me, so I can't be seen with the weird guy. I really hope that getting boys and being popular is worth losing who you are. So after class, we'll go looking for the next guy. Brianna, don't wear your glasses. I can't see anything. Why do I have to change everything about myself to get boys to like me? Why can't I just be me? Brianna, wait. This is just so boys will fall in love with you so you can find your soulmate. Once you find your soulmate, you can go back to being yourself again. And who's to say my soulmate's going to love me for who I am? No one else does. Brianna, you lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. You lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. Hey, Brianna. Your grades have been doing phenomenal. You're looking really good these days. I like your new look. I'll see you in class. Do you think it was Mr. Stevens that fell in love with you? For his wife and kid's sake? I hope it's not him. Okay, right in front of you, that's Chad. He's one of the hottest guys in the school. Go up to him and ask if he would like to attend Devin's party with you. Kevin's walking this way. So? Hi, Kevin. Don't talk to me. You're too cool for me, remember, Brianna? <laughs> <laughs> Brianna, what are you doing? Go talk to Chad. Right. Chad. Hi, what's your name? I'm not sure we've met before. <laughs> Stop. Boys don't like it when you cry. I don't care. I don't care about Chad. I'm in love with Kevin. Is Kevin more important than your soulmate? He is. Then go to him. Kevin, I... Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend and girlfriend. Me too. <laughs> I love you, Cynthia. <laughs> Mommy, I promise one day I'm going to be a princess for real. No, you should never make a promise. Now you only have 10 years to fulfill your promise or else. Or else what? I go on timeout? A permanent timeout. When I was 10 years old, I made a promise that I would have kids one day. Now I have to have kids by 20. Whoa, that's so young. I know, I didn't know about the 10-year rule. When I was 6, I made a promise that I would be a princess. Brianna, that's never going to happen. There's no way a prince would marry an average citizen. I know, I'm probably going to be dead in the next year. Attention everyone. What is going on? The prince is throwing a royal ball to find his princess. Even all you common folk are given a chance to impress the prince. Switch bodies with best friend or boyfriend. I wonder what living in my boyfriend's body would be like. Yo, I already switched bodies? I wonder how long I'm going to be in this body for. Yo, that means I have a pick. I wonder if Jake came to school today in my body. Hi, Jakey. Hi, Stephanie. Come here. <laughs> Whoa! Why did you just do that? You're Brianna's best friend. Why are you acting surprised? We do it all the time when she's not around. We do? Yes. You're a bad friend. We are not best friends anymore. What? Yo, bro. Fist bump? Yeah. How's Christine? Christine? Your new lady? How many ladies do I have? Dude, I can't even keep track at this point. He's cheating on me? Hey, Jake, Brianna's looking everywhere for you. Uh-oh. Where is he? I mean, she! Gummy, gummy. What's this? You pick whether you want to be dating or married at 20. I want to be married to a prince. Mommy, why do I have a bandage on my finger? Hey, Jake, you have a bandage on your finger, too? Yeah, I do. I guess you also chose to be married at 20. Yeah, I did. Good choice. It just sucks we can't remove these bandages until we're 20. I know, right? But my birthday's tomorrow. Wow, lucky you. You're officially 20 in 3, 2, 1. Happy birthday! Now you can finally remove your bandage. A ring. Choose to speak to your soulmate or choose to speak to your mom. My mom passed away when I was 3 years old. How could I speak to her? Hello, sweetie. Mom? Mom, is that really you? Yes, it is really me. I'm so regretful that I couldn't be in your life more. It really is you. There's so much I've wanted to tell you. Hey, Mom? Yes, sweetie? 
I have a date tonight. I really like him. Aw, that's wonderful. Will you help me choose an outfit for it later? I've always dreamed of my mom helping me get ready for my first date. Of course. Mom, these questions are really hard. Could you help me? Who are you talking to? I'm talking to my mom. She's dead. I got a choice this morning to talk to either my mom or my soulmate. Brianna, I don't want to tell you this, but that is not your mom. Brianna, I don't want to be the one to tell you this, but that is not your mom. I am your real mother. She doesn't know what she's talking about. She doesn't even know me. You're right. You think you know my own mother better than I do? You're just never happy for me. Brianna, wait! Ella's mom, what are you doing here? Ella never came home from school yesterday. Since you're her best friend, I thought you might know where she went. I don't. I'm sorry. Jake, we have to cancel our date tonight. My best friend's missing. I'm really worried about her. That's no problem. Get some rest. You've been talking to Jake a lot recently. Yeah, I really like him. Honey, hurry downstairs. I have a surprise for you. Surprise! Ella, Jake, I don't think they're breathing. Since you like them so much, I brought them to you. Brianna, did you take my blush? Wait, before you speak, I want you to know how important it is for you to never lie. Because when you lie, you'll forget all memory of the person you lied to. Okay, I took it. I'll be back, sweetie. I'm just going to get some milk. Okay, Daddy. But, little girl, what are you doing in my house? Go back to your own house. You don't remember me? Daddy lied. Okay, I'll go back to my own house. Alright, Mom, I'm heading to school. Listen, just hurry up and send the child support. I need it. Who are you talking to? Your father. Father? But I don't have a dad. I've never had a dad. Fine. Don't tell me then. Class, I'd like you to meet our new principal, Principal Stevens. Brianna, it's so nice to finally meet you. Go team! I knew you would win, Jake. Of course I won. You were cheering me on. Look, it's Porky the Pig. Get it? Because you're fat? <laughs> My name's not Porky, it's Cynthia. Porky, I can smell your Big Mac scented sweat from over here. Stinky, funky, like, ew! Why are you so mean? <laughs> Why am I so chubby? How did I gain so much weight in a day? Oh no, did you make someone insecure? You were born with a curse. If you make someone insecure, you'll get their insecurity. So you're saying I'm stuck like this? I'm ready for cheer! Brianna, you really let yourself go. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll lose weight in no time. Well, until you do, you can't cheer with us. Are you serious right now? <laughs> I'd like to audition for the cheer squad. Porky, you're skinny? I told you, my name's Cynthia. Wait! Cynthia, I should apologize. More bloopers. Don't do it. She said do this, not do that. I mean... I can smell your Big Mac scented sweat dripping off of you. It's disgusting. Stinky funky like ill. Mommy, why did you... <laughs> Mommy, I have hearts all over my face. Oh, you got your hearts, but you only have three. Those hearts represent the amount of times you're allowed to be heartbroken. Every time someone breaks your heart, you lose one of your hearts. So what happens if I have no hearts left? You die. <gasps> hey, besties. <clears throat> Pizza face. <laughs> Jake, stop it. You can't sit with us. Everyone's looking at you because of all your pimples on your face. It's embarrassing. It's just a little breakout. I've been really stressed recently. You can't sit with us. Is my acne really that bad? A heart's missing. That means they broke my heart. Hey, babe. Whoa, what's all over your face? Yeah, babe, what happened? It's just pimples. It will go away. <laughs> That's your girl, bro? She's not my girl. I'm not. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. I only have one heart left. I can't get heartbroken again. I know what to do. Whoa, Brianna looks hot. Hey, girl, come sit with us. Yesterday, when you said I couldn't sit with you guys, you made me lose a heart. I can't trust you guys won't break my heart again. You never even deserved it in the first place. <laughs> babe, you look so good today. I'm not your babe. Yesterday, you didn't want to be with me because I had pimples. You made me lose a heart. I only have one left because of you. 
I can't trust you won't break my heart again. I'm sorry. Class, we have a new student today. Everyone meet John. You can sit wherever you like, John. Hey, can I sit here? Sure. Do whatever you want. Lucky me. I get to sit next to the prettiest girl in the class. Look, I'm not interested. I can't risk getting involved with another person again. Hey, wait. Why did you say you can't risk getting involved with another person? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left, too. How about we take the risk together? I only have one heart left. If I get heartbroken again, I'll die. I only have one heart left, too. How about we take the risk together? Okay, let's try it then. But just know, if you break my heart, you'll be considered a murderer. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, babe. Hey, can I ask what happened to your other hearts? How'd they get broken? My best friends and boyfriend broke my heart because they didn't like the way I looked. You may not notice, but I have really bad acne under all this makeup. That's so superficial. I would never do that to you. Wow, you're so strong and muscular. <laughs> thanks. I want to kiss you. Brittany, I... Why would you... John? It's not what it looks like. Brianna, she came on to me. I saw you. You kissed her. You don't have any hearts left. Brianna! Good, you're awake. How am I alive? Where's John? Who do you think gave you the heart? He gave you his last one. One million dollars or gummies? Obviously a million dollars. <clears throat> oh, come on! Oh no, they're all grape flavored. That's like the worst kind. Mmm, these are actually good. How many of those have you eaten? I don't know. The bag just keeps refilling itself. It's great. Well, you might want to have a look at your hands. What do I do? The purple, it's spreading! First of all, you need to stop eating all those gummies. I know, but they're just so good and I'm really stressed out. Are you still eating those? I can't stop eating them. I'm taking them away. No! Where did you put the gummies? Look at you, you're all purple. You can't have them. I need them. I ate them. Oh no. Look at your skin, it's... it's... Hey, mom. I spy with my little eye my mom. Here, take your vision blocking glasses. I spy with my little eye these vision blocking glasses. Wear them as much as you can so you don't have to say I spy all the time. I barely take mine off. I spy with my little eye the ground. I spy with my little eye the bush. I spy with my little eye the bus. Class, can anyone tell me why the earth is flat? My eyes are so itchy. My glasses, where'd they go? Timmy, say I spy. I spy with... <laughs> I spy with my little eye a beautiful girl named Brianna. Chad, is that you? Of course it's me. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I... I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. Take off your glasses so I can see your beautiful eyes. I don't know. It's not really safe. Come on, Brianna. I just want to see your eyes. You know you can trust me. Okay. Give me those. I spy with my little eye, Chad. Give me back my glasses. No way. I lost mine. Catch me if you can. I spy with my little eye, the wall. I spy with my little eye, Chad. I spy with my little eye, my vision-blocking glasses. Hey, give them back. back. No, they're mine. And if you have your eyes open, you need to say I spy. I spy with my little... Chad? Chad? Attention everyone. For population control, you may no longer wear your vision blocking glasses or keep your eyes closed for an extended period of time. Anyone who breaks these rules will be killed. I spy with my little eye. So, how was the kiss? It was alright. Thanks, Professor. Only two more to go, and then I can finally meet my soulmate. Good luck. Brianna, who's next on your list? Eugene. That'll be easy. He's such a nerd. Hey, Eugene. Basically in quantum physics. What do you want? Want a kiss? I don't know. I'm kind of out of your league. <laughs> Eugene, just give me a chance. Please, please. I guess. Just don't tell anyone. I don't want anyone finding out about this. Trust me. Neither do I. Thanks, Eugene. You're so mid. <laughs> only one more to go. Kissing a thousand people is a lot of work. I only had to kiss ten. What? I have to kiss Jason. So? He's my best friend. I'll make things weird. 
Only one more to go. Kissing a thousand people is a lot of work. I only had to kiss ten. What? I have to kiss Jason. So? He's my best friend. It'll make things weird. Jason. Buddy. Bud. <laughs> Why are you acting weird? You're the last person on my kiss list. And then I can meet my soulmate, so... No, Brianna, I can't kiss you. We're best friends. It'll make things weird. Are you serious right now? Jason, how about you kiss me on the cheek? That way, things won't be weird. I guess that's fine. It didn't work. It has to be on the lips. See ya. Wait! Jason, you're being a bad friend. A real friend would help me find my soulmate. I promise I won't tell anyone about this. Brianna, the real reason I don't want to kiss you is because I don't want you to find your soulmate. Why not? Because I'm in love with you. My first word is only three letters. It's going to be so easy, like cat or dog or something. No, that wasn't a guess. One more wrong answer and I'm out of the game. No 10k for me. Just hurry up and guess something. If you're out, you're out. Okay. S. Just two more letters to guess. You should guess X because what if it's... Get your head out of the gutter. X. Just one more letter left to guess. Guess E. No, what if it's not E? I can't mess this up. Oh. The word six. The next prize is 50k? What's my next word? A challenge for $100,000. Wow, that's a lot of money. Cut off a chunk of your hair. I don't want to do that. I'm not doing it. Brianna, once you've accepted the challenge, there's no turning back. You must do it or they'll kill you. What? A challenge for $500,000. I just got a challenge for 500k. Don't accept it. The more money they offer you, the harder the challenge will be. I can't pass up on that kind of money. Shave off your eyebrows. You shaved your eyebrows? Yeah, I did. Does it look that bad? It does. I accepted a challenge for a million dollars. Wow. I have to kill you. The red rose or the black rose? I want the black rose. It's black like my son. No, honey, what have you done? What have I done? The red rose is the rose of life. The black rose is the rose of death. Everyone will be scared to love you. Because if someone breaks your heart, they'll die. Hey, Brianna's kind of cute. Look at her face. She has the black rose. If you break her heart, you'll die. Oh no, I better stay away from her. Now, why is a pretty girl like you sitting all by herself? They're afraid of me because I chose the black rose. If they break my heart, they'll die. Ah, get away from me! Now, why is a pretty girl like you standing in the hallway all by herself? I don't know. Come here. Jake! You did it! Now, why is a pretty girl like you standing in the hallway all by herself? I don't know. Come here. Jake! You did it! No, no, it wasn't me! You must have been in love with Jake, and seeing him kiss me broke your heart. And now he's dead because of you. No one should be allowed near her. She's dangerous! Hey, Bree. Hey, Bestie. I haven't seen you all day. We can't be friends anymore. What? Everyone's judging me for being friends with someone like you. You're too dangerous. Please don't do this. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bestie! She just killed her best friend! She's evil! An absolute monster! Hey. Stay away from me. I'm a monster! You're not a monster. Look. You have a black rose. Good morning, Brianna. How may I assist you today? Mom, why is there a robot above my head? Oh, you got one. You're lucky. Only a few people were chosen to test out the new AI assistant. Hello, Brianna. What can I assist you with? No thanks. I don't need any help. You can find someone else. Hello, Brianna. How may I assist you today? Look, I told you I don't need any help, so just leave me alone. Hey, baby. Jake, I missed you so much. How may I assist you, Brianna? You can assist me by never speaking again. <laughs> 
Jake! You killed him, you stupid robot! Hello, I am Brianna. Help, help, I'm the real Brianna! How may I assist you, Brianna? You can assist me by never speaking again! <laughs> Jake! You killed him, you stupid robot! Hello, I am Brianna. Help, help, I'm the real Brianna. Somebody get me out of here. Your line is, how may I assist you today? <laughs> ha 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 ha. Hey, Bri, I've been looking for you. Hi. No, stay away from Stephanie. She's my best friend. We are best friends. Yeah, why are you acting strange? I am not. <laughs> how did you just shoot laser beams out of my eyes? Don't underestimate the power of AI. I am Brianna. Brianna, there you are. I'm a part of the AI assistance software team. We've come across a problem. There is no problem. Brianna, did you take my makeup mirror? <gasps> I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. Now you're going to have seven years of bad luck. Bye, Mom. I'm leaving for school. Hurry now. Don't miss the bus again. How would I miss the bus again? I'm leaving 20 minutes early. No. No, 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 wait! Hey, Bri. Hey. You're all sweaty. Sweaty? Yeah. I walked to school. Here's your lunch. <gasps> You're not having good luck today, are you? No, I never am. I dropped a mirror back when I was 10, and now I have seven years of bad luck. Come on, that's just a superstition. Is it? Today's the day. My seven years of bad luck are finally going to be over. I'm going to grab lunch. Hold my makeup mirror real quick. Wait! Brianna, your crush is coming. Act natural. Kevin. Sup? Hey, I'm throwing a party later. Wanna come through? Are you kidding me? I'm short one gem? <laughs> oh, why would you do that? Sorry, Kevin. Let's skip class and go to McDonald's. How can I be short half a gem? I can't. I have to go to class. Hey, do you want more gems? Yeah, of course I do. Then drink this. Oh, what is this and why is it yellow? Just drink it! That was disgusting. What was in that drink? Look at your gems. Two billion gems? Sweetie, is it time for school? Yes, I think so. Sweetie, you need to ask, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 8 a.m. It's time for school. Mmm, lunchtime. Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 12 p.m. It's time for everybody to eat lunch. Except Timmy. It's time for Timmy to be my lunch. No, Mr. Wolf, please! <laughs> What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for everyone to go home. It's time to go home. I'll see you tomorrow, Bestie. Stay safe. Me too. Mom, I'm home. I'm so hungry. Mom, is it time for dinner? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 5 p.m. It's time for me to have my dinner. <laughs> Mom! Sissy, where's Mommy? It's time for dinner. She's just... Sleepy. Why is there a timer above my head? Sissy, hurry. You need to ask. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Ask what? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for everyone to go home. It's time to go home. I'll see you tomorrow, Bestie. Stay safe. Me too. Mom, I'm home. 
I'm so hungry. Mom, is it time for dinner? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 5 p.m. It's time for me to have my dinner. <laughs> Mom! Sissy, where's Mommy? It's time for dinner. She's just sleepy. Why is there a timer above my head? Sissy, hurry. You need to ask. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Ask what? Stop. What are you doing? I'm drawing an ice cream. No, you can never draw on yourself. Anything you draw on yourself will permanently be on your soulmate. Forever. Brianna, what are you doing? Relax, I'm just drawing a heart on my face so it'll be easier to find my soulmate. Okay, but I don't think your soulmate is going to be very happy with you putting a permanent heart on his face. He'll thank me later. You ready to go to class? Brianna, look at your face. Oh, he is not going to get away with this. Revenge isn't the answer. What did you do? A permanent mustache. Let's see how he likes that. I don't think my soulmate's very happy with me right now. Wait a minute. He wrote an address. I don't think my soulmate's very happy with me right now. Wait a minute. He wrote an address. He must want you meet him there. Are you going to go? Of course I am. I gotta go home and get ready. What are you doing? Covering up the 69. It's so embarrassing. That was weird. Ah! It came back! You can't cover up any of the drawings your soulmate gave you. It will always reappear. You know, they really need to make a handbook for all these rules. This is the address. No way. You actually came. Hi. You have the heart on your face. And you have the 69 I drew. Yeah, thanks for that. I'm Brianna. Nice to meet you. I'm Jake. Look, I shouldn't have brought you here. You need to leave. Immediately. What? Run. 